I'm gonna curl my mustache like the olden days. Ooh. All you ever wanted, all you ever needed to know. What's up, it's Slater with the 60 second review of Ice Plant. This found in the St. Augustine Distillery circa 1907. The working distillery that you can go on many tours, taste many different offerings that they have, and maybe one of my favorite parts of visiting St. Augustine. Recently, of course, seeing the Christmas lights, but this in particular makes you feel like you're back in the early 1900s how they have everything set up. Uh, decoration's really great. And also the food offerings, as you can see, the menu, very, very extensive, which means if you like this, like that, they honestly have it all. Also, their bartenders, extremely knowledgeable. So if you say, hey, I uh, want something with vodka in it, or I'm um, feeling whiskey, they got you all covered and will customize it to what you like. And if you don't like what they have, well, then they'll make you another drink. I ended up just going for drinks and appetizers. I will say the fish dip with the kettle chips, the best thing of that was the kettle chips. Uh, definitely made in-house fish dip. I'm not gonna say it tasted like cat food, but unless you like cat food, then uh, have at it. Overall, the experience that I had really great with a fantastic server and bartender, I'm gonna give it a big old heck yeah. If you find yourself in St. Augustine, stop through the distillery, check out Ice Plant, and enjoy anything from breakfast to brunch to lunch to even dinner. Does anybody actually want cat food dip? It's perfect.